A lot of families are having a tough time making ends meet this holiday season. But imagine losing everything you own just days before Christmas. That's what happened to one Charlotte family this week. News Channel 36 reporter Tony Burbeck is live now to tell us more about them. Tony. Sonia, what happened here was a fire. In fact, you can't see in or out of this window right here because it's caked in soot. This window over here, this is where firefighters broke in to let some of the smoke and flames out. Still plenty of glass all over the place right here. What this ended up doing was affecting a family with four kids. You can see where smoke billowed out of Nathaniel Walker's house. Inside these walls is where almost everything is burned or melted. 80%, 90% of the house is damaged. They can't live there, it's not livable. This was the family's new home they moved in about two months ago. An eight-year-old son, a four-year-old, three-year-old, and seven-week-old daughter just home from the hospital battling spinal meningitis. Their Christmas gifts burn too. If it's not burned, the smoke damage, like I said, the newborn, so I can't use any of that stuff. And we had a lot of gifts. They also had a dog. It died in the fire. They just got him for protection after someone broke into the house. The question two days before Christmas is what now? Kids like presents under a tree. Unfortunately, I'm not rich. The answer? Well, the truth is, sometimes it's not that easy. I don't know. I don't know. I don't have an answer. And the American Red Cross is helping the family, but they do say they're not exactly sure how long that's going to last. They know it's at least through the end of the week. As far as Christmas presents, well, you heard him. He doesn't have an answer for that either. We're live now with the Mobile Newsroom in Charlotte. Tony Burbeck, News Channel 36.